some benefits to having the laptops is uh, for research papers. When you're uh, looking for information, that way we all don't have to go down to the class and try to look up the same thing or different things and just be up there and waste kind of the class period. Uh, you know, I feel like the computers is definitely a, uh, a tool that helps you get deeper into whatever you're studying at that point. You know, where it's just you get a lot of different perspectives about um, about the stuff that you're running instead of just the teacher's perspective. You got Google, you got you know, all these different search engines, and, and you know I've actually learned a lot more on the computers than I've learned just by myself through you know like an academic reasons. So you know I feel like it's gonna gonna be beneficial for college to know about Google Scholar and stuff. Like that. All right, the good things about computers is that it helps our generation because we are such good with technology and we can get on anything we want to in our free time. The good thing is it makes it a lot easier to turn in your work because you can turn in your work without even your teacher being there. Um, some of the benefits of having a computer in the classroom is you definitely have unlimited resources. Um, you can look up anything and everything on the internet. I think that if you're really struggling with a project, you can go to Google and type it in and it gives you idea after idea. And um, sometimes that can be bad, but I think that a lot of times having so much information really helps kind of spark your creative juices and it really helps out in the research papers and things like that. Okay, so the most challenging things about the computers are, uh, first of all, a lot of people get sidetracked easily with um, social media and other games that are available to us on the computers and they find ways around the um, web filters that are provided by the school. Sometimes the assignments don't submit and sometimes you just lose your files. You know, the computers can, can be a big distraction since you have so many resources at your, at your you know, hands. So I, sometimes I'm looking up sports scores or, you know, I'm playing a game or Tetris or something like that because it's just so easy to get distracted just like it is at home, you know, if you're like, working on your computer, it's easy to go to Facebook or something like that. So it's, it's definitely can be distracting, but if, you, if, uh, if you're motivated, I feel like it's definitely a big benefit for you in the end. Negative part of the computers is when our servers are down and we can't turn in any work, therefore we're behind on our new day and that's pretty much it. I think uh, having laptops, just depending on the kind of student that you are, um, given so many different possibilities and opportunities to, to do different stuff, uh, you know, they can be a distraction. It's just, you know, uh, kind of what kind of student you are. Uh, if you want to make yourself better and learn better, I think they're great, but I think it can be a big distraction for kids that just kind of want to get by. Some of the most challenging things about having computers would definitely be the distractions. Um, I think that social media and um, just all the games that you can that are available on the internet it's very distracting, especially while trying to do homework. I think one of the other downfalls is um, I feel like we've been given more homework. Uh, it's a lot easier to grade things. It's a lot easier to put things into the grade book, so I feel like um, we get more and more homework. I, I definitely feel like I do more homework. I think the technolo technology that is available to us here is going to help us after high school and in college because we are given different applications on the computer and uh, different programs and we're taught here how to use them so whenever we have to use those in the future for college and other careers and that we that we have um, we will be prepared and we'll know what we're supposed to be doing and how to use the program instead of having to learn later on I think what? computers will help us because it'll help us for jobs that haven't been created yet and be more high technology and we know everything about computers because that's part of the future. Something that I like about the laptops um, is the note taking stuff. You can do um, video, OneNote, all different programs out. Um, I think taking notes in college is, is going to be huge and I think um, just having a laptop as far as the research and writing papers. Um, an organization, that kind of thing, not having to carry around a bunch of stuff and not losing things. Um, I think that'll really help me in college.
Um, I think this can help me better with my future because I can use it um, for college by being able to research better and my, my computer skills will come easily to me and it will benefit me with the future things that I have to use that are technology based. And basically I'll have um, the whole world in the palm of my hand. I think technology will definitely help, um, learning about this technology will definitely help us after high school because online classes are such a big thing right now and I think that um, for some students who are very independent thinking and are able to teach themselves things, online classes are a good thing and a lot of our classes right now are almost like we're taking online classes. You turn in your stuff before midnight and you make sure you have that day's stuff done um, and it's it's almost run like college some of the time. That I Challenging, experiencing, frustrating, okay, and preparing. Takes a lot of responsibility. Uh, I think the computers are efficient and uh, uh, help ensure creativity. Students advancing with the technological world. It's a different way of thinking that's both challenging and rewarding. It's all knowledge in my hands. Laptops are more efficient. Hey, tell you what, it's going to make us all nervous.